Before this video starts, as a reminder, all rights of this show go to Disney. I am in no way own any of this footage except for the reaction. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoy the Yow House community. Okay. What's up, YouTube? It's me, BD Heath. Hey, back here with some more Owl House Season 2 B first episode reaction. Follies at the Coven Day Parade. I need to start this over. Can you start this over? Okay, okay, okay. Heath? Just because the show is back does not mean you to go into a mental state of destruction yet. It'll happen. It's not right now. You have to wait. The first episode. You cannot freak out on the first episode. It cannot happen. We're gonna start over. Start over. And we're gonna keep and we'll go from there. We're starting we're going from there. We're starting we're going from there. Breathe. Calm down. Okay. 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 I'm not gonna put this in the recording. I think. God damn it. Ah. What's up, YouTube? It's me, BD Heath. I'm back here with some more of the Owl House Season 2 B drops today. Now, for me, it's nighttime, but um, it dropped today, and I said, I'm gonna stay up until this thing drops, and it finally dropped, so we're here to watch it. You probably already, if I included that first clip, it was a failed recording of me trying to act like I could do the introduction. I couldn't. Didn't do it right. So, but now we're here. I'm high in energy right now, if you can't tell. And I'm really excited for this. You're gonna see you're gonna see less of it though, probably, because I want to limit the amount of time I actually have in my reaction videos. As before, they've gone over an hour. I'm trying to make them about a half an hour, so you guys don't have to watch a full hour of me talking. As but I'll still talk, just not as long. So, we Gucci. But yeah, let's go ahead and jump right into this. I'm excited, you're excited. And if you guys want to see more of the Owl House reactions featured on this channel, on my part, the like and subscribe button down below. And comment down below, the Owl House is back, baby, or something amongst that line. Yeah. Okay, let's get going, shall we? Oh, here we go. I'm not ready. Are you ready? Because I'm not ready, guys. I'm, I'm re really, 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 really not ready. Hola, mama. I know you don't want me staying in the demon realm, but I'm recording this because I think we can find a middle ground. This... If I put this in here, you're going to see the Lion King opening. Ha, ha, Because that's the best news I've heard all day. We've been waiting for a middle ground, and we were hoping it was going to happen at the end of the season. But instead, we're getting it right now. Also, I know I said I was going to talk as much, but that's some major news to me. So, yeah, let's continue. It's a world of magic and beauty. True, Just true. look. <laughs> Um... What?! Hoodie? I... Wh was that Hootie, like, taking a... I, I almost said something even stupider than that clip. But w w why did I think he was taking a bath? There's no safer place than Hexide School of Magic and Demonics. Right, Principal Bump? Wait. Hmm? <clears throat> why, yes. The well-being of our students is our top priority, which is why we send all our troublemakers to our new and improved detention pit. Oh, please, no! Help me! The app is lagging, and I really cannot comprehend the fact that I might be able to watch this right now, because I need to. Also, and while we're stopping, um, I, there was nothing in, in the instructions, so I'm just going to bypass that all. So if you don't see the instructions in this episode, that's why. Nothing new. Same as it was before in the previous half of the season. We good to go? Cool, cool. We good to go. Okay. What's he like under all that? He's oh, uh, him. I never got a good look. I heard he's scarred from wild Hi. magic. Hi! <sighs> Amity. Hola, Batata. Did you just call me a sweet potato? Yes. Is that not a term of endearment? Ugh, I'm still figuring out this human language book from Gus. That's adorable. That's so adorable. Oh my god, that's so adorable. That is the most adorable thing I've ever seen in my entire life. That is... Oh, no, that's not true. But still, like, still, it's amazing. She's learning Spanish. 
Oh my god, that's that's so cute. That is that is just so. God, I I feel so good watching this again. But the fact that I have a copyright strike makes me worried about even posting it. But we're gonna be fine. We're acting like it doesn't happen. But this is adorable. Yeah, best thing I've seen all day. Hootie thing was even creepier than that, honestly. Aw, Amity, you're the sweet potato. Uh, so, did that Titan blood ever come in handy? Did you finish building the door? She didn't tell- oh my- okay, okay. I know I said I wasn't going to talk much, but we had to analyze two things there. First being the fact that those two- she- this is- mm, oh my god. This- this is- it, every single artist's dream right here is coming true. And this is episode one of the season two B finale. F season two B episodes. Like, they're getting screen time, first episode, and they're being mushy with one another, which is amazing. But on top of that, she didn't tell these guys about the door yet. Like, it ha- oh god. I can already see conflict occurring. Unless she actually does tell them, which is good, but she won't. Please! Ow. Okay, mom. I promise. That sucks. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I haven't used the door yet. I'm waiting for a good moment, you know? What? Nita! Huh? Ah! Oh my god! Wow! Ah! Oh my god! What the? Mm. Oh my god! 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 Whoa! Oh my god! <laughs> Dana, you are a great person, and I love everything about you. Oh my god, what just happened? That's not even- <laughs> Guys? 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 <laughs> I was picturing this in the finale, not this exact second. What do you mean? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh god, my sweatpants almost fell off. This is not good. I need to make sure I sit down. Can we just analyze that for a second? I'm shaking. I, 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 I genuinely was not expecting this. This is so unlike Disney and so much more like Dana. I didn't even think this was a possibility. And you were here. We're sitting here watching this happen. Luz just kissed Amity. Yeah, <laughs> boy. In the first episode back. I'm not mad. I'm happy. Uh, believe me. I just, I, I'm just, I'm trying to comprehend that in my mind. Slowly. Later, taters. Huh? Oh my god. Oh, she just doesn't move? Okay, that's fine. <sighs> Shit. Oh no, oh this is so good, it's so bad, but it's so good. It's so good and bad at the same time. She, so she just doesn't move. She's, what? So she just doesn't move? I, I don't even care. She's, she's happy. She, they're happy. They're a, <laughs> they're a thing. They're <laughs> I was not expecting that much mushy mush in the first episode back. And even if that's all we get, that's all I needed. Because it happened. It, it happened. It did happen. So, there's nothing else to complain about it, guys. It did. Sure, I know you'll be like, well, did he kiss on the lips? It doesn't count. Shut up, let me be happy. I'm sorry. I, if you're new here, sorry. But, like, the fact that this is even on TV, on Disney, is remarkable. So, I don't want to hear any complaining. This is happening now on screen, and this is the first episode back? I need to be prepared for like a mental breakdown when I come back home to watch the finale. Like, I am so screwed. Oh god, also my parents are pissed off because I'm waking everybody up in the house. Okay, I was trying not to talk as much anymore, but that's not gonna happen, is it? Listen, I can't come home! What? If I don't lead this parade, Bellows will end my- No, 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 I- of course I miss everyone. I- what? I, I can't choose. Hello? Mother- Mother! Ooh. That's, no, that's, okay, I, th th that's important to note, and here's why. Because we've never seen conflict with Kikimura before regarding Belos. 
That's what's interesting there is because we've always we already seen Hunter already be like, yeah, I'm gonna do this and that. That time Uncle what's going on, along with getting a palisman, but. We've never seen Kikimura have a major issue with Bellos before in his rules. And that's important to note because it's showing how even though Bellos has a powerful empire in this area, in the Boiling Isles, it's crumbling from the inside. It's not even, like, they haven't done anything to him. It's not like Eden lose uh, convinced Kikimura of this. She's already having issues with her own family and Bellos' rule. And it's time to pick between the both of them. And her family is not getting the, the, getting the good side of it. Guess why we're here? King? Ida hired someone to spy on her ex. Ah, did you read my diary? And they're head witch of the Bard Coven. Stop it! And they Stop also... It. It. Yes! They secretly led a rebel group against the Emperor and got captured. Uh That's cute. 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 Well, I'll stop saying that now. It sounds annoying, doesn't it? Um... Just regarding that point of... Um, <laughs> like... Got so Ida's got relationship troubles. Luz might have them if Amity watched all those videos, which she did. So we already know that they already have not issues per se, but more of just oh no, she lied. Yeah, they have issues. Well, they all have issues, but I'm not gonna see this relationship fall and crumble before it gets to where I want it to. Am I? And then Rain battled their fellow coven heads and sacrificed everything to save Ida. It's just like Hecate and Azora in Book Five. According to this, oh, did she? Rain that wasn't the that wasn't the episode. Luz had it on an audio player. <laughs> That's great. That is great. I'm sorry. I, I really do mean to stop pausing and talking, but there's just certain things that need to be discussed. And the fact that matter is that everything in this show is unlike other TV shows that that runs this stuff along for a long period of time. <coughs> One piece. Um, you need to make sure and remember that the, most of the stuff in these shows that are shorter, but like the Owl House is, is getting less screen time to explain stuff that's going on. And so you guys don't know what's going on unless I explain it. And you guys want to hear me talk. You want to see the show. So I really don't have much of a choice. Yeah. Anyways, let's keep going. Let's keep... I'm still thinking about that Lumini kiss. I'm gonna put, put it on screen again. I don't know. I'll think about it. <laughs> And then she, she said if I don't make it back for the family reunion, I'd be banished from Palm Stings and the family home. But I failed too many missions, and if I leave my job now, I'll be banished from my life. There you go. It's gonna be okay. It, is it? That, that sounds really serious, I'm being honest. Uh, it's not like it's something where it's like, you know, it happened, move on. This is a serious deal. Because I'm more concerned about what Bellos is thinking about with this. Then Kiki Moore's problems, like while well, I feel bad for her, Bellos is much of a more greater threat. So let's think this through. Uh, Call it the Ed Ricochet Eleven. Hi That's Ed. How many times I, I was sent to you. the Healing Coven? Ooh, wait, are these legal? Would that make you more or less interested in buying them? <laughs> you know, yeah. Say, so yeah, yeah, you, you can buy it. You can buy it. <laughs> oh God. Uh, if I skipped around some parts, just so you guys know, um, they're gonna cat kidnap Ida and- sorry, they kid they're gonna have Ida. They're gonna kidnap Kikimura and Rain at the festival. Folly's Covenant Parade. I didn't say festival. I never said that. Um, they're gonna kidnap them both at the fest- Parade, and they're both gonna get them back to the Owl House. That's pretty much it. Let's keep going. And I guess it has. Are you okay? So, Luz has been acting super weird, and I think she's lying about her trip to the human realm, and she left her foon, a uh, fun, uh, her thingy at school, and... <sighs> That's a mood, first of all. And second, so she, she knows, then, because, yeah. But she's not as mad as I thought she'd be, which is good. I wasn't meant to be, like, pissed either, but she's not majorly upset, so... Can't be mad about it. Also, I want to mention this is the first time that I have we've seen a Amity and Willow scene since I think what well, I, I mean them separately together since like what um back in season one of Weeping Willow in the Tree area. So this is majorly good um character growth again because the, since they had a fallout back when they were younger. But this is really good for both of their characters in my opinion, and I'm glad they're doing this. Helps them out. Um grow as individuals so it makes me feel a lot better knowing that they are doing something about it and not nothing 
But that being said, Amity is here about Luz and not Willow. So I'm not sure how Willow will feel about this, per se. Ugh, you know I hate these things. Talking to people, waving to people, people. Ugh. But I'm just happy to do my part. You seem so much more calm than before. I am confused. Why is Rain so calm in the first place? They were captured. By Kikimura! The, the person who captured you! Bellows. <laughs> you did something. What'd you do? I, I, I gotta know. Soon. Let's hope for the best, ladies and gents. This might be bad. <laughs> Why do I feel like Rain and Ida are gonna fight instead of helping? I don't know. Tara's been helping me recover. I can't remember anything with these uh, headaches. Yes, Sprout. Drink your tea. Ah. The plant coven is making Rain forget Ida? Is this just currently this completely? If it's the past two, we've got a major problem. Like, major. <laughs> it's a very big problem. Very big. <laughs> and this is really not good? At all? <laughs> like, I'm <clears throat> sorry. <clears throat> Dying. Um, yeah. Help, please. We need that right now. Almost time. Is that our float? Not bad, right? <laughs> I love the fact that I'm getting I'm getting Rio vibes from this people. You know the movie Rio with the movie with the birds and they had the chicken float and it looked like crap. <laughs> I'm glad they like their float at least. <laughs> so there's that. But another thing I'm bringing right now, just shortly. You notice how many clips from the trailer are inside this episode alone right now? I mean, they definitely didn't show the kiss. That's not the point, though. <laughs> the, um, the amount of tiny snippets that were in that 15-second promo trailer that are in this these few episodes alone is ridiculous. Because you know that this what's going to happen is they're not going to show any footage from the next few episodes at all. They're going to make us anticipate and have anxiety for, like, seven weeks not knowing anything. Um... Get off, you two. Let's get cracking. Mission success, Hootie. Is it though? I'm very confused right now. Why is it that? Mm, I, mm, okay, look, look, look. I'm not one to, and you guys already know what happened, so I don't need to explain it. But why? I, I'm just wondering, as I don't think Amity knew about this. Why is she not? Like she's trying to help. She's trying to find Luz, but why did she not approach them? I don't know how to say this. I don't know how to say this. Like, I know she couldn't see them. Like, they literally were invisible. But, like, the thing is that... How... What fight? Ugh. It was just a few weeks ago. I was with you. Ida, I spent the last month sick in bed. And we... We haven't spoken in years. Ah! Damn! Ah, heart... Break it, dying. Like, <laughs> I don't even know what to say to that. That just... <laughs> it's, it's cracking, fading away. <laughs> and Ida is confused as shit. And I don't blame her, because she has a right to be. Because the plant... Where is where is the plant coven head, by the way? Is she just kind of watching from, like, a sunflower in the distance? Like, this is cute. This is funny. It's a good attempt. But this is really bad, because... Without Rain knowing what's going on, they are going to not go with Ida. Burr. Head witch of the plant coven. Terra Snapdragon. Ah. Uh, yeah, that ain't good. Amity, where'd you go? <laughs> we might need your help here. Even though Luz is a badass as it is. I'm pretty sure we could 
we could. Pretty sure we could use some help. Yeah, that's what, my, that's what I was going to say. I'm not sure why my board stumbled. But we could use some help right now. Help is always open for the taking. And Luz has never fought a coven leader before, I don't think. But she did fight Bellos and managed to survive. So I can't really comment on that. Hey! You know? How did you know? Book 5, Chapter 8, Azura pretends to kidnap Hecate during the ice festival to save her from the wizard clan. You remembered my favorite part. Yes, but right now I just want to keep my girlfriend from being sent to the conformatorium. It's a good plan, and it's just adorable. Oh my god, I love this. I love this. I love it. 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 Here's what I love it. Here's what, here's what I love it. I know you guys be like, all he cares about is in this show is Lumity. Here's the thing. While that is partially accurate, what also is accurate is this. While we are getting Lumity moments, we are getting more than that by seeing other characters at the same time. We are getting development with Amity and Willow this episode in a way. We got development with Rain and Ida. Not really, but it's there. We got, we've got development with Kikimura and Bellos with his rule and how it is unfair to Kikimura. We're getting more coven heads. There's so much going on right now that there's nothing to complain about if people care about Lumity. There's literally nothing to complain about. You're getting everything in this episode. There's literally a mixture of everything you've ever won in this episode, and there's still seven minutes left of it. Probably five with credits, so that's not the point. Let's leave me alone! For old time's sake, I'll give you one last chance. Move. Please. Uh, I'm sorry. I mean, I, it's not that I'm laughing. It's the fact that this is just... I don't know what else to do. I, I, I don't... I can't yell because my parents are asleep. I can't cry because I can't cry because something has happened in a way that makes me want to cry. Kind of. And then as for laughing, that's just my last resort. So I, I'm giggling because I, I don't have an answer for giggling, if that makes any sense. Hopefully some of you guys can relate to that. But... This is really, really good, but bad. Because while Ida's trying to reconnect the dots in Rain's head, they're not going there, clearly. And they have no idea what's happened to them at all. And it sucks. It really does. You really are a kind person. Wow. And an utter fool. <laughs> what? Palm stings can burn for all I care. You heard, Terra. They want to promote me. Me! She lied. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Sorry. Uh, dying. I don't know what else to say. Um, She lied. She did that literally just to be able to find where you were. And you had to be by the one little tiny beer bottle that was just sitting on the ground next to you. You were lied to in order to get caught. When you go back to the Emperor's Coven, you'll probably be fine. Well, Bellos is still going to lecture you because he's been like, how the hell did you get captured? Thank you. Yes, thank you, Luz, for all the help. You're ah. wrong! I mean, ah, dang it! Yeah, what? Okay, nope, that, we gotta stop there, you know? We just, we, we gotta stop there, how in the moment of death, or being captured, they were like, yep, let's hold hands, you know? Because that's what girlfriends do. Badasses. Like, look, I could go on with my life knowing that there's a ton of different scenes in every episode leading up to the finale of Lumity, but I also kind of don't want that. I know that sounds really stupid, but I know I don't, I know I don't want that either because I do want to see other characters in this show get character development apart from these two. That being said, this is adorable and no one can complain about it. This episode, it just came back on TV. <laughs> you got an amphibia to watch too. I still have to write to that. That's tomorrow morning because it's too late at night right now. Happy Coven Day. Amity, Amity, Amity! You saved me! How can I make it up to you? Uh, maybe you can tell me about this? <laughs> Yo, it's so cute because we got another hug, but then you gotta pull out the phone and be like, yeah, what the fuck this? <laughs> Just ruin the mood completely. Eh, it might be good though, might be good. 
If it means another kiss, I'll wait for it. <laughs> In all seriousness, I'm glad that they're going to talk things through, hopefully, on screen. In a room where we can see what's going on and not have it time swiped away from our minds so we never know what happened in that conversation. I'm okay taking things one day at a time. Yep, same here. But I can't help if I don't know what's going on. Facts. You just looked so hopeful. You were even learning Spanish. Yes. And I thought if I helped out Kikimura, maybe there'd be hope for me. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> I love it. That's not a that's not an air of disgust. It's an air of yay. <laughs> so, so it's just, it's like I'm sick from the amount of emotion coming from this episode. I'm dying slowly. Help me. <laughs> uh, it's the fact that they're talking about all of these things that we were making comics and art about the first episode back. It's not like they just delayed this for five episodes. This is the very first thing they talked about was this scene and everything that happened in the last episode back in season 2B episode Ten. So this is really good to know they're talking about this right now and not later in time. So that's what I'm, I'm really happy about that right now because people worried they were going to mention it or Luz wasn't going to mention it at all. They were going to pass over the fact that they brought it up, but they are mentioning it. They are bringing it up. So I'm happy about it. Also, we're on a bridge. No one else is around. Fireworks are in the air. Dana, if you put on the kiss scene, I'm be happy, but have a heart attack so just chill out but don't ah thank you everyone hi together we are perfecting the coven system as the titan intended uh -huh. the day of unity will be in exactly one month oh so wait wait hold on now now, now we gotta talk because if that means what i think it means disney if you're gonna postpone the day of unity until season three special specials specials i'll be mad because i was hoping we would get three extra and this is me i was hoping to get three extra season three shorts of like future amity and lose like when they're older but if the day of unity is all season three specials that are four minutes long that might be bad for me because I can really record 20-minute episodes as it is without talking, so... Yeah. Thank you, Boiling Isles. We love you, Grandpa! <laughs> Happy Coven Day! I don't like how he was just so open about that. Is he just trying to regain their trust, or what? It's like he knows he's in a bad spot right now. He's like, I gotta regain their trust somehow. This is how we didn't do it. Not even mad about it. Not even mad about it at all. Makes perfect sense. Makes perfect sense. And it doesn't. So I'm still confused. Uh, okay. Alrighty then. Uh, that makes somewhat sense, I suppose. Of course he is. And why did he say he's gonna meet you again? Uh, didn't you already meet? What else don't I know? What's gonna happen? Mm. I... I'm not sure. This is so... Ah! Now, ah! We'll take things one day at a time. Yep. Yep. Oh, it's so cute. 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 It's so adorable. And it's so painful because it's because she's got a point. It's like, like, what's going on now? Like, Bellos looks so nice in this mess, in this episode. The next episode is going to be like, I got to kill some kids. So this has got to be like, what you going to do next? What's the plan? What are you thinking about, buddy? You know, like, what are you doing? And with what you're doing, why are you doing it? You know, add that message in there. Please. Enlighten me. Why are you doing what you're doing? Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> um, look, guys, this episode was spectacular. It was amazing in every way and shape and form. It gave us a mixture of the show's content of what's going on in the show right now. Gave us a recovery moment with Willow and Amity. Even though Amity didn't go there for Willow specifically, Amity still went to approach Willow and they made up in a sort of way that made them feel better about being around one another that was good because we've only seen amity with willow or gus or losing gus or somebody was with amity and willow at the same time that's all we knew but i want but this there's so much in this episode to unpack and i'm sure someone's gonna do a breakdown of the episode maybe i might do a breakdown of the episode i don't know i won't show any scenes it'll just be me talking but i'm sure if you guys want to see that 
I can do a full on breakdown of the episode and just talk it through. If you want to see that on a live stream or a podcast, is that a thing I can do? Then that would be great for me to do so I can talk about the episode more in detail because I like to do that a lot. But I figured you guys want to see the episode reactions of me and not the entire episode through talking. So here's what we're going to do. If this episode goes up without being taken down, praying, um, then we're going to go ahead and do a breakdown of the entire episode along with the amphibia episodes as well at some point. That is basically the main quality of my content the next like eight weeks because there's so much going on in TV shows right now that I can't even keep up with all of them. But until that happens, we got this stuff to deal with. So I hope you guys have enjoyed my reaction. If you have, hit the like and subscribe button down below. It means a lot to me more than you know. And if you already, if you already want to see the next episode of the Iowa House like I do, because you know I do, hit the like and subscribe button down below. Comment down below. Um... Dana Terrace, thank you, because we already got Lou's kiss and Amity in the first episode back, and that means that a full-on kiss has got to happen, hopefully in season 2B and not season 3. So, let's just hope for the best, guys. But you've been watching me on BD Heath, and I will see you all in the next episode. Have a good one, and I will catch you in the next video. Peace out. Have a good day. Okay. <laughs>